Hello Universe, it is Josh here with you once again, Spaceboot1 being an internet code name. And um, what's all this, you may ask? Um, well, these are dispensers in case uh, in case you don't know. I've just retextured them and given them a different recipe, but that's not the point of this video. What I want to do in this video is um, some is I want to do a featured build. So what I'm doing first is this is basically a randomizer. And so we've got jungle wood, so from here it's like multiple randomizers. And jungle wood, and then what pops out here, we have galoob stained clay. I think that's at the very end here. Yeah, that'd be that. Let's see. Yeah. Uh, let's there it is. Okay. And <laughs> cake. Okay, so cake is our first featured block, and featured block, no, no, we don't need these now. I think I can throw them away. Featured block number one is cake. Featured block number two, um, this is oak wood, so that's here. And that's yellow wool, so that's here. And <laughs> brick slabs. So. Our randomized um, build is going to consist of cake and brick slabs. Bricks slab, is that spelled right? Oh well, anyways, <laughs> there's our two featured blocks. Uh, so let me load up, uh, save and quit the title. I'm going to load up a new featured creative. And it's going to be creative and world options. We're going to go with default world. Um, we're going to this is creative. Uh, yeah, we don't want super flat or anything. So create. Okay. So do you remember the featured block? Cake and brick slabs. Now the the idea there's very loose rules sort of regarding this. Oh, perfect. Okay. Um, I was going to try and find somewhere, you know, flat and open to build, so this is actually pretty much ideal. I don't think I need to travel very far at all, because this is just being creative. Well, let's, uh, let's put some armor on, uh, first of all, just for the sake of, I don't know, I guess looks. <laughs> um, and I wanted to do, I would need some colors. Today I'm going with sort of uh, that color palette there. So what do we got? We got um, nice light blue hat, a more darker blue tunic. Um, what did I want? Yeah, gray pants and white shoes. Okay, not that any of this matters, but um, oh, where were we? Here we go. Let's. There we go. Now we have some. We can handle this. Uh, any kind of weather that the world throws at us. Okay, we'll just fly up and just have a little look at the terrain. Yeah, we don't need to travel um, very far at all. So, the first thing I want to do... So, if it's going to be... Uh, see, I like to have um, stone and dirt readily available. In fact, these are going to... Well, here, I'll put them in the there. Um, but I also like to have Kind of your standard building materials um, ready to go. Uh, okay, and we, we went with cake. Okay, so uh, I guess the first thing I'm going to do is um, a little platform da, 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 so that let's see featured block brick and um, maybe I'll just make that three. And featured block cake. So the idea is to build a building or a house out of uh, out of these. Is that cactus floating or is it just me? I think it was just waiting for the world to load. Sorry, I shouldn't be getting so distracted all right away. Okay, so these are my two featured blocks for the build. Uh, so we want to build a building out of <laughs> brick slabs 
and um, hmm. Okay, so slabs is actually kind of new to me. Um, hmm. I think I, I think the first thing I'm gonna do probably is something like maybe an oven. Um, get out of here, sheep. Okay, and I can't. Yeah, that's that goes like that. Oh, that's kind of like imagine if I had. Oh, it disappears. Okay, I didn't know that about cake. That's too bad because I was almost thinking I could like do. Um, let me see. Do a nether rack uh, down here. Light a fire in there. What do we? We need a tool. We need flint and steel for fire there and yeah cake won't go on top of the fire <laughs> put out some fire okay but maybe um, maybe 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 I don't know but maybe our bakery can be something like <laughs> well that didn't exact didn't quite work out the way I wanted it to um, okay new plan new plan new plan that there that there okay so that's all right. That that's oops. Um, there. So that can be like sort of the core of our building. Um, we might even do like several of those. Make it a real um, kind of operation uh, if it's a real bakery. In fact, I think yes. I'm quite pleased with that as the core. Now, question: uh, Is that where I want to build it? Because the center of the featured build is here and I think I want to continue to use this world um, for future featured builds um, so what I might want to do is actually put this whole factory somewhere a little bit out of the way because that's there's you know a testing area there and then if I just swim across the river I don't think I want to put it in the swamp but there's a nice flat area up right here that I think would do nicely okay so I think I'll start with that indeed as you know kind of our center um, and the question being what sort of floor should we do like should I do if I do a wood floor here and if I go ahead and do nether rack in here I think this wood can catch on fire so I don't want that um, so I may want, uh, what if I used nether rack, where is, or nether brick, here. Yes, I like how this feels. Okay. So there we have, like, sort of a middle, and then we have wood for you know for walking on and basically because it is a cheaper material um, although <laughs> I guess this is featured build so theoretically we can build out of anything we like um, I guess the idea is that I, I do want to build buildings that are sort of uh, possible to recreate in um, in survival mode because I'm so used to survival and it's, it's like uh, basically an ingrained uh, part of me I sort of I always build with survival in mind. Um, so basically using the cheap materials like the wood instead of making the entire thing out of nether brick. Although that would be kind of cool too to have like a nether brick bakery. Um, so that, yes, that's... that is good. Um, I'm tempted to raise this up a little bit actually. Mm, that's too too high. I don't like using wood slabs, but I might have to do that. Let's let's just try them out and see what it looks like. Da, 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 da. Um. Yeah, there. Uh, well, I like that, but you know, even more than that, I like the idea of. Okay. Well, I sort of like how the way that feels, although now it's starting to feel rather large for a single cake. Like, um, 
you know, cakes are great, but they're not that special. Okay, so we're gonna actually <laughs> we're gonna get rid of this. I guess this gonna this video is gonna be a lot of um, adding and removing of items, um, and I think the next thing I want to do is uh, let's get the full brick block back because I want to start doing like a wall, and I think this might actually make me feel oops better about the inside of this. That feels pretty cool. I kind of like that. I like how that worked out. Um, and in fact, yeah, if we do now that you know that it comes to duplicating, uh, we need some nether rack here. Threw away the glass. We might need glass later, but that's okay. There, and then we need some nether brick in the floor. A nether brick in the floor. That's my singing. How do you like that? You know, it occurs to me that my voice is a little bit monotone for this, but uh, that's something I can work on. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I don't. I don't know how to improve that right at the moment. Anyways, okay. So two of these furnaces f feels. The other thing is, I wonder if I shouldn't be like. I yeah, I like that too a little bit better. And then we'll do the same thing here, there. Um, I'm going to keep it daytime, just because. And then we're going to do it another, a third one. And I think three should be all we need, because once again, this is the sort of featured build that you want to be able to port over to survival fairly easily. And at this point, if I do like, you know, five or six, they're gonna, all going to pretty much be the same as this. So there's no point in just duplicating the same thing over and over and over again. Um, well, I, yeah, I do like that quite a bit. Okay, I'm quite happy with how that's already looking. Um, da, 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 I should, let's see, I'll do it this way. Now, yeah, I'm going to sort of encase all of this. Yes, good. Um, Mm -hmm. Okay, so yeah, we, so look at that. We have some some cakes cooking, and yeah, I'll finish off this bit of floor too. Um, and then I got to decide how far out I want to bring this. Okay, well that's a good, you know, definitely. Oops, a good start to the building. Um, the question now is sort of, um, I guess you want you want like a way to climb up here because you need like somebody's obviously got to put these cakes down or or pick them up um i suppose you might have those you know those big paddles uh to pick them up or whatever but still um could be as simple as just doing a ladder let me see ladder here and just do you know not too close to the fire so the ladder doesn't burn and then just up and i should watch this wood cuz i'm not sure if that's I think that's far enough away that that wood is never going to catch fire. Yeah, okay. So basically, yeah, there's an access point up here. kind of think that that ought to be a metal ladder, but there isn't a such a thing as a metal ladder, so that's alright. Um, yeah, okay, that's good. Uh, and I w I'm wondering if I shouldn't see for the edge, if I shouldn't actually bring it out a little bit like this, and and this is always good on builds because it keeps the spiders from climbing up onto the roof. But also, I kind of feel like it gives us a little bit of a walkway, and it keeps things oops uh, keeps things interesting both on the outside and on the inside because in the inside you have it looks like that, on the outside it looks like that. Actually, that you know that can be improved I think because it looks very plain. Um, but still, it's what's inside that counts, right? <laughs> That's a weird thing. What is, what's inside the building that counts? Um, yeah. Uh, another... Th <laughs> it's funny that this featured build was supposed to be more like build a house out of cake or whatever. So, 
obviously I, I don't think I want to build a house out of cake because I think that would be a little bit lame. Um, although, thinking about it, let me see. You can stack these up. <laughs> Shift clicking in creative is a little bit <laughs> it's a little bit difficult, but yeah, you could so I could theoretically stack cakes like that and have like a fantasy cake house, but I don't oh, and that breaks them all. Yeah, that's the other problem. It's very fragile if you break the bottom one. None of those cakes in the stack are gonna stand up. Um, okay, so we've got that going on. This is very good. Um, I think what we need next is we need a place for the cakes to cool down. Um, and the question is, oh, you know what? I have a good idea. I think this is going to work. I think what I'm going to do is oh, but now I need to go underneath and actually activate these things. Okay, well anyways, <laughs> it's a little me messy down there, but I don't actually expect to go down there um, again. And then the thing, the point of this was to have cakes on here cooling. Um, and it occurs to me that nine is probably too many. Um, ta -ta, there we go. Six is probably more appropriate. And uh, the other thing I can do, well, yeah, I should make it a straight, a whole line of these. Yeah, I'll, I'll go ahead and do that. All the way to the to the edge. Um, maybe leaving a, a gap here. So it looks a little bit off center, but that's kind of that's how it is because this this way is more of an access to the furnaces. Um, and then what we need to do, I may actually need to, to make the basement a bit more accessible. Um, da -da 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 okay, there, there, okay. And I guess I'm just gonna basically line this whole thing, because th these are not, like, functional pistons, they're just for displaying um, the cake so um, we'll close that up for now there we go and then I won't um, the other thing I won't do is uh, I think I'll like leave some spaces open kind of so like as if uh, some cakes have been taken or sold or whatever because I guess this would be a, like a shop uh, basically, um, and then maybe like be interesting if this would be a whole nother project. But like, if I can make this river actually a little bit more navigable, and like actually have a boat that sort of takes the cakes away and delivers them to somewhere. Um, but that's you know that's for another time. Uh, I feel like this is pretty good. And then sort of, I guess what we'll want uh, is, I want to do a doorway on the side here too, so like for workers to access and whatever. Um, I ima I'm picturing customers sort of coming in the front here. Um, yeah. Well, let me just let me do a door in here actually, and also let me do a, a cobblestone um, road, cobble ro cobble road, and it's just going to be a wooden door I think. Uh, we don't want anything super special. Yeah, um, I think I'll, I will put a button by the door there. Okay, so. Even though it is wood, it's just... And this cobblestone path, you know, can go to the next build or whatever. Um, very good, okay. And, uh, yeah, I don't mind how that looks, although... Uh, maybe it could be improved. Not sure. Um, the other thing I want to do is, like, a row of... Oh, not these, not dispensers. Droppers, dispensers. 
I want to do a row of furnaces. Um, I want to do something like that, and I won't actually put anything in them, but that sort of feels like it belongs there. Um, and the next thing, we have furnaces, and I think, is that a normal chest? Yeah, that's a normal chest. I think a couple of um, a couple of chests, and these chests are not supposed to be able to. Um, they're not supposed to go back like back to back, um, even though that's sort of the design I want to. I could use a trap chest, um, but I don't like using trap chests like without an actual reason. That could work. Um, I guess what I can do with the furnaces is make it something like this. I almost want to put um, something in here. What if I put just glowstone lamps? Uh, we need glowstone. We need redstone, and we need something to power them. Let's use levers. Uh, so there, there, there. There we go. Okay, that feels furnacey. Um, I kind of preferred the way I had it a second ago, um, but this does allow me to do something interesting with the chests. Uh, and also, I want to put something in between these chests, um, but not lamps. Although, if I put a ceiling on this, everything is going to be need. Everything is going to need to be lit up a little bit. So I suppose lamps are not the worst idea. Um, also, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna extend this just a bit, just a little bit. There, there. And we're gonna do some more furnaces. Where did the furnaces go? They're decorative, not redstone. That furnace faces that way, and that one faces that way, and then we we move these chests over just by one. Okay, there. Okay, good. And it didn't occur to me like before that this building was going to go all the way, like hang over the water, but it looks like that's probably what's going to happen. Is we might have to. Well, I don't know. Oh, this is cool. There's like a natural little cave under here. I wonder if I should make use of that somehow. Um, hmm. Well, this this feels very right. It feels good. I guess the last thing I need, the, the final um, item that I need, is I need to sort of uh, finish up this outer wall. Um, how should I do this? I think I'll, I need one more space of that. Okay. Yeah, hello, bat. Okay, so that's kind of cool, but yeah, the thing that I want uh, here... There we go. Let's just finish the floor here. Is I want a nice big window, because that's what you often see in bakeries and stuff, is, is just a nice... Uh, nice big window. I should also make use of the, in fact I will make use of the slabs here, something like that. I like the feel of this so far. Um, I don't know if that's a big enough window. Yeah, you know what, I think it is. Um, then there's going to be like a customer entrance here. So that'll be uh, double doors. And should I make them iron? If I make them iron, they'll look kind of foreboding, to be honest. And I'll, I think what I'll do is I'll just make them wood and then sort of leave them open like that. Um, leave them open and inviting, like, you know, come on in. You know, have some, uh, have some cake, cake shop. And then in, in here, I'm not going to actually fill these chests, but the idea is... Um, there would be uh, both supplies, there would be uh, maybe other things for sale, 
uh, there would be maybe a few gold ingots in there just because people have you know dropped off gold to help out or whatever um, so there that's some of the things that you'd put in there oops not that um, let's do some more glass let's see how this looks on the outside too um, that looks okay I guess I, I, I need to um, one of the things that these sort of brick buildings always need is like some decoration like maybe some flowers I think flowers would be pretty nice um, I'm gonna do cobblestone uh, outside the front door here and I'm, I'm thinking yeah I kind of I, I did kind of run out of space here um, I sup I could almost build like a little bridge across. I suppose that's not really part of this bri this this build, but sort of there really needs to be. I guess this is going to be like a like a raised causeway basically, and it'll it'll eventually go to other buildings um, around here. Sort of, you know, almost like a cobblestone street out here. Uh, let's do. Let's go ahead and do some supports in here. What's a good support block? Um, probably stone brick, I think. I think that's that's a good one. There and I, um, yeah, I would normally go right down to the um, the stone level, but I think that's sort of does it for now. Okay, so now thinking about what to do with this um, this roof bit a little bit, I, I kind of want to do like, ooh, I was just going to do that, but even sort of, oops, no, that's too much, but even that, I kind of like how that works. Oh, and I, I'm standing on some hmm, some stuff here. And I, yeah, sort of this cobblestone road will be elevated above the river so that there can be buildings sort of on either side. And there might be like a stairway down to the river and then little boats. Um, but, you know, that's not... This build is not supposed to be about that. It's supposed to be about um, about the... Well, I guess it's turning into basically a bakery. Da, da, da. Okay. I should probably just use straight grass blocks on this, but in fact, um, where are we? Grass. Let's use actual grass, just so it's, so we are properly, we don't have to wait for grass to grow on here. There. Um, so there's that. And I kind of want to just do... Would it be too much if I just did that the whole way around? Because then that doesn't feel as special. Because this, this window feels like... You know, it's got an awning over it and it's fancy. Uh, I kind of want to do something different with this window too. Yeah, that opens it up a little bit more, a little bit nicer. Um, Let's let's do brick half slabs all the way around. Uh, I'm tempted to just go yeah here. I'm I'm gonna go ahead and bring this cobblestone road right out to the front. And should it be like actually should it be right next to the building? Like obviously we have all the space in the world here. Uh, but I imagine um, sort of in the fantasy world that we're building for there's going to be other buildings and structures around so what they probably will want to do is have this path as close as possible maybe leave a tiny bit of grass space um, there and we're building with real grass <laughs> and then this yeah this is going to go I'm going to keep yeah I like keeping these roads as as flat as possible that was 
that was not intended for, oops. Um, hmm. Okay, we need this. Uh, there. There. And then Cobblestone Road, and of course, yeah, it continues on wherever it happens to continue on. There, 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 there. Um, I suppose I might be getting monsters spawning underneath here, uh, if I'm not careful. There, 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 oops. Just finishing off this bit of road, okay. I guess, uh... Another thing we'll, that they need is they need um, some street lights. This is probably going a little bit beyond the scope of, um, yeah, <laughs> scope of the bakery, but might as well. Hmm. And that's not exactly. Uh, that's not quite what I want, but well, that's not really part of the build, so that's fine. Um, the other thing I think I should do is maybe feature some half slabs out here uh, and do like, hmm, like, oops, not there, but uh, something like, oh, is that going to look wrong? That's not what I, I almost want to move everything out one more block so that I can have another layer of grass in between. Maybe make, yeah, one more of these. Make this all grass too. Just so I have enough space for some interesting feature. Oh, I can see the grass is also changing color too. Um, and then what I want to do, I don't think a fountain well, that would be another reason for having this road out that way a little bit more, because this way I can't really fit much in here. Although, here's a this is an old trick. Uh, let me see. Uh, we we'll use some trap doors. This is like something that has people have been doing in Minecraft for years and years and years to make interesting um, features. Uh, we'll go ahead and we'll a flower on top of there. There. That's nice. Um, these could be flowers too. Why not? Why not? Um, I almost want to put like a free sample, like free cake sample out front too, but maybe not today. Maybe that's something they only do once in a while. So, you know, maybe today they don't have it. Let's just expand out this road just a bit. Okay. Um, okay, yeah, okay, we're good, we're good. Uh, so this is looking good. Um, so the last, I think the last thing I need to do on this building, I think, is um, some kind of roof. Now, what sort of roof would a sort of a, a bakery like this have. I'm, I'm thinking it should be a flat roof. I almost want to put like gravel on the roof. Um, and yeah, sort of like what if I, oops. Let's see if this, what happens here. Oh, I kind of like that thought. Oh, but then you can't. Um, let me see. It's got to. It has to be higher. It has to be at least high enough that, like, a worker can can walk around under here. Um, maybe at the front. Maybe I'll leave it something like. In fact, yeah, I think I'll fill in sort of. So at the front, it feels very. It's, yeah, it's like that, 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 like so. Um, and then, 
yeah, I gotta fill in. Oops, up there. Uh, let's start from here. Yeah, shall we? Same thing over here. Um, let's turn that. In fact, that almost looks better with that little slab cut out. Yeah, I like that. And oh, here, these are full blocks. Yeah. I think what I'll do instead here also is even something like <laughs> maybe is that is that too too um, not no I like that I do uh, another day what about we have we've done four days so far of this <laughs> building this building has taken us four days to build. I kind of want to do another one like that. Is that too busy? Too? I think it looks okay. I think it looks just fine. Uh, eventually, I'm gonna have to to um, play through the night because this whole building is gonna have to be lit up. Above this, what we're gonna want is actually like some. I don't know if it'll be like holes in the roof or, or chimneys or basically I guess it's gonna be chimneys. Um, not there. Up. So yeah, we're gonna have, have to do that like so. Um, Sure, but so there's that, and yeah, I may do um, like a here. Let's grab some iron bars and iron bars. Da, oops, da. Okay, there. Iron bars. Iron bars there, iron bars there, iron bars, Th oops, yeah, not there, there, iron bars there, mm. there, okay, and then I wonder if, I feel like this is getting very monotonous, um, it's, well, it's time to feature <laughs> these again, these brick slabs again. That feels right to me. And I'm going to fill in all the middle of this too. It's not just going to be um, open. So, um, <laughs> that's a fair amount of bricks. Like, if you're playing in survival, this is going to be a, a fairly brick heavy um, build. Uh, in some ways, I suppose you could replace this with cobblestone or something like that. Um, I like, I think the brick is sort of essential for the inside here, but um, yeah, you could replace the outside bits with cobblestone. Uh, so the next thing I want to do is something like, uh, let's see, can we do, yeah. Oh, but I don't want to do bricks for this. I, don't, I want the ceiling to look a little different. What if I did the ceiling out of sandstone? Like Okay, next <laughs> next item of business. Gravel, 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 gravel. Okay, we're doing gravel ceiling. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Well, that's um, that's definitely the idea that I wanted, and there's <laughs> hmm. Maybe I think what we need at the top here is a little bit of reminder of why we built this building in the first place. 
Oh, I kind of I haven't done much with sta with the brick stairs. Um, so I'll grab them, and we have cake. Okay. So I kind of want to do like. Um, sort of like these are oops. these cakes up top here are sort of um, like they're not <laughs> I imagine like either they put them up here and they're simply like basically gone stale and all the moisture has left them um, oops let's do something like two what if it's something like that Yeah, okay. Yeah, I kind of like that. I think maybe this needs something. What if it was... Now I'm just kind of <laughs> random, but... What if it was... Oh, that's not going to work. Well, maybe. Mm, maybe not. Maybe. Oops, not like that either. Um, how many? That's five, set of five. So let's go two from the edge. I don't know. That's kind of a random thing, but it sort of <laughs> sort of fits. Um, so, <laughs> uh, stone brick. Just wanna just wanna prop this up a little bit more. Just so. Oops, not there. There and not there. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Do you think I should put some bone meal down, or just I think maybe just some grass here and there, like just one or two? Does this kill the grass? Hmm. That's that's unfortunate. I'm not sure if that. I think it just hasn't grown yet. Actually, I don't think it's. I don't think half slabs kill grass underneath them, because um, obviously you can see there's one here that's actual actual grass um, okay you know what I like that as a front and I like that as our featured uh, featured front and um, hmm this looks like it could use some more support now uh, should I use bars yeah I'll use I'll use I don't know if I should use bars all the way but There. How far away is that from the edge? One, two, just three blocks. Okay. I think that's yeah. I think that's how I want it. So blink, 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 blink. Oops. Blink and blink, 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 blink. Okay. So. Yes, and yes, and this is... Okay, so, front is done. Let's have a look on the inside. Let's walk inside. Ooh. Um, definitely, I actually like that, the way this color is. I like the dark, the lighting glitch, darkening that up. I'm not sure if I like how we how we ended up with this seal. Uh, yeah, it's, it's fine. I think the ceiling's fine. Um, then, yeah, there's a ladder here for workers, and they can climb. Now, it, I can check the light levels here. I, creepers might be able to spawn up here. Light level. Um, I think. Oh, okay. <laughs> sunlight gets in here. Okay, so yeah, no worries about that. I don't think. Anyways, um, yeah, so sort of, I guess there's a bit of a dark spot here. Uh, block light is four. I don't know if sunlight's getting through. You know what? That's probably enough lighting in here. I don't mind if it's a little bit dark because we got some nice bright light here. We have some fires in the back, and it's actually kind of nice if you can contrast, if you have, 
you know, the warm fires in the back and then some, some darker areas away from the fire. So, although I have to ask, is, is this fire not giving off any light? Yeah, <laughs> I think these fires aren't, are, um, maybe I should, let me see, what do we got? should sort of, this is good too because it's like, I mean if, if these fires weren't nether rack, it'd be like, yeah, you'd have to keep on feeding them, so at least there'd be sort of this justification for kind of a hole in the back for you, for the fire to be fed. I almost think the fire, the hole should be in the front, but um, yeah, maybe not. No, I, I like that. Okay. So I'm quite satisfied with the inside here. And I'm satisfied with the front. So the question is, this side, um, this one is not too bad because there's an interesting, like, you know, a door and a pathway here, but it still has this very large, and then look at this, it's just a flat brick wall. Just, just what are you doing? Um, but, you know, maybe that's fine for, for you know, the back of your building because maybe what we're going to do on the other side is there might be, you know, there, a different building that abuts back here. So that would become an alleyway. Um, so maybe it is just important to do the front and not really worry about the rest. Um, so in that case, yeah, I'm going to call this uh, featured build done. Thank you for sticking with me for the whole... Well, I've been building for an hour, but it, I will cut out some parts of it, so you won't have watched the whole thing. But um, thank you so much, and um, uh, stay tuned for other stuff on this channel. There's going to be Space Boot One's Garden is, is a series that's still going on, and there's going to be more building episodes and featured builds. And um, uh, what else? Uh, modding, more modding that I'll do, and just general interacting with the community, because that's sort of what I'm... Uh, here for is just more than anything else just uh, you know talk and share about Minecraft and stuff like that so um, thanks for very much <laughs> subscribe uh, like and talk to you later